You know, our industry the past 10 years has seen so many trends come and go. You know, there's been, you know, at times people are, you have to do social, you have to do casual, you have to do hardcore, you have to do this, you have to do that. But as much as it's been changing, all of those different trends have been supporting each other. What I love about this console is that I think it's the first time that these trends are going to really be brought together. This is where the promise of what we can do is bigger than just one genre. This time, uh, Sony came around to us and they came to our office and they said, here's what we're thinking, what are you guys thinking? What have you been held back by and what would you do if you didn't have any technical limitations? That they gave us the possibility to provide feedback and, and to adapt based on the feedback they received from developers was for me a very important message. All these developers had a hand in actually helping form what the PlayStation 4 would eventually turn out to be. We took all that into consideration to create the system that just works. When we think about the word simple, we've chosen to interpret that with a comparable word, elegance. And to us that means this balance between how complex the simulation or the options or the interfaces are with how deep the experience you can get from it. The more elegant a design is, then the more simple and easy it is to get incredible depth where you can have a deeper experience that's still not really complicated, but it's much richer and much more immersive. Everyone has, to some degree, some instinct of craft. They want to make something their own. They want to make it a representation of themselves to other people who know them. Through personalization, there can be a relationship between the kind of content that I'm interested in and how the options are presented to me. So this system actually is very much aware of the player and what's going on in the room at any given point. So for example, when I go to the PlayStation Store, right now I see advertisements and commercials for a lot of games that I'm frankly not interested in. Having a good way to present you the games that you're interested in is very important for us. If we want everyone to be engaged in gaming and, and love it and understand it, we just got to make it easy for everyone to get into that and not waste everyone's time. That doesn't involve three minutes of boot up and disc shuffling and sort of all of these things that are just like a nuisance between the impulse to play a game. So immediacy becomes an important goal. I want to make the decision to experience something or to access something and I want it right now. There isn't any more waiting time, there isn't any more startup. I literally walk in, pick up the controller, hit the start button, it just goes. It's a huge win for gamers. You're able to download the first bit of the game and start playing it before the next 20 gigs download. One button press away and you get what you want. Historically, console games have, have been very much like lived in a tower. You go to your living room, you have that experience there and that's where it happens and then like you leave your living room and then you have the rest of your life. Looking ahead, integrated gaming experiences will follow you everywhere that you go. The entire world has changed in the way you can interact with many devices wherever you are at any time of day. So there'll be some window into that entertainment experience that's accessible through your phone or your PC or a portable gaming device. The many different devices that you use are seamlessly integrated to create your PS4 experience very seamless. There was a time when the shared experience meant that your friend sat next to you on the couch. Now that we can basically project that across the globe. Offering them opportunities to interact with each other, you know, while they're playing the game, but also outside of the game. The new big feature that we've, we have on this controller is the appearance of the share button. The share button allows you to record any gameplay uh, and create a video or a screenshot and share it instantly. Whenever they want to share an epic moment, they can just press that button. Before you had to make a video, edit the video, upload the video, and now we're going to make this so easy for people to just like press the share button and off it goes. It's going to bring opportunities to engage players with the game and with each other um, like we've never done before. One of the neat things about next generation hardware is there's always kind of this, this mystery. What is the, the actual ceiling of this thing? What is the potential? How far are we going to be able to push it? The possibilities have just blown open in, in a way that in previous generations it never had. This is what PlayStation is about. It's about innovation and it's about new ideas. PlayStation 4 というのは、まあ、非常にプレーンなシステムですから、まあ、白のキャンバスみたいなもので、えー、すごくクリエイターにと,とってこう腕の振るいようがあるんですね。あのすべては、えー、クリエイターが何を、えー、そのキャンバスに書き込むか、えー、がすべてなんですね。Because at the end of the day, everybody does like 
that. Everybody does want to see new, amazing things. For me, the three words that we'd recap would be... Immersive. Magical. Simplicity. Ultimate. Play. The game entertainment machine. It's coming soon. It's a connected world. It's a PlayStation.